I'm tapping my foot impatiently, waiting for the grey polished metal doors to slide open. They remain closed for far too long. So I stab the button with my index finger one more time for good measure. No sooner as the doors begin to part, I step into the lift, twisting my body sideways to fit through the gap between the opening doors. Once inside, I turn and face the lobby. I poke the sixth floor button and wait for the doors to close. Why is everything so slow? Suddenly, the lift judders and shakes me from side to side. The lights flicker as I hear cables and metal collide above me outside the lift. Instinctively, my arm shoots out to one side, my hand slamming against the polished mirror interior to stabilise myself. My stomach drops with intense weight, causing my knees to buckle slightly. Then, in the next moment, all was normal once again. But this is just the beginning. First floor. Doors opening. What? I exclaim, looking at the panel with all floor levels illuminated. No, I protest, and start to hit the button marked six with the outside of a clenched fist. I continue to hammer the button, not even attempting to be accurate at this point, but the doors start to open anyway. I look out onto the floor, expecting to see co-workers waiting, but this was not what I saw. As the doors opened, like a theatre curtain revealing the stage, my fist immediately stops hitting the panel. Paused in mid-action, frozen in position, I stare across the floor, my mind struggling desperately to comprehend what I was seeing. 